Jay Bolecki from Bahar Ganj. Hello. All right, listen. <laughs> listen. I stay in Bahar Ganj when I come to Delhi, and a lot of people have been saying, why do you go to Bahar Ganj? They say, Bahar Ganj is the dirtiest place in Delhi. It's the worst place in Delhi. Don't go to Bahar Ganj. And so today, I want to show you Bahar Ganj because I have a, an idea, an intuition, that many people who say don't go to Bahar Ganj actually have not been to Bahar Ganj. So yeah, this is um, Bahar Ganj. And Bahar Ganj is, you could say, the tourist capital of India. No, that's not true. The tourist capital of Delhi, I should say. So what happened was, many years ago, I hope you can hear me over the noise of traffic. Many years ago, people used to travel to India, not by aeroplane, but they traveled overland. And they would travel through Iran, through Turkey, through Serbia, through Afghanistan, through Pakistan, and into India, Nepal. And in every of those countries, in the capital cities, they would develop these streets that had restaurants and hotels and everything that tourists would need. There was Chicken Street, there was Freak Street in Afghanistan, in Kabul, in Nepal. Um, the capital every... city of the UK is not London, it's actually technically Westminster. Okay. All right, there we go. There's a fact that you didn't know. Um, and so, Bahar Ganj is the one that they created in Delhi. And here is everything that a tourist would need. You've got your restaurants, you've got your hotels, your cheap hotels, and you've got your souvenir stalls. You can buy your pashminas here, your... Wow, he's under here, Like Mexican. So everything, so look, when tourists come to a country, they kind of want everything in one place. And that's what Bahar Ganj is. And that's why, although it's not the cleanest, not the tidiest, not the neatest place in Delhi, still, this is where foreigners come in Delhi. Bahar Ganj. Let's carry on looking around. Let's see what they got in this little place. Here we've got some restaurants down here. Hello, what's up? Guess it, Tiga. That's yeah. The thing that you need to know about Bahar Ganj is you're going to find a lot of people, a lot of tourist touts. They're not representative, really, of Indian people in general. Indian people do not hassle tourists, principally. But in Bahar Ganj, that changes a little bit because people are trying to get you into their shop, get you to buy things. So. That's a negative side of Pahar Ganj. You will be hassled if you stay here. But be strong. If you want something, you want something. If you don't, you don't. What about up? Yes, sir. Yeah, us. Leather goods, huh? Leather bags. Let's see it. So you need to be strong when people are hassling you, you know? If you don't want to buy something, ignore them. Don't go into the shop. All right, let's carry on looking around. Here we have, look, this is what we have for tourists in Pahar Ganj. You can have like henna tattoos. Is real tattoo or henna tattoo? Both is possible. Ah, both is possible, yeah? You want? Do I want what? You want tattoo, henna? Not now, not now. Man. I'm making video. Fighter. You do the real tattoo or somebody else? <laughs> Buddha. Shankar. Buddha. Acha. This is Siva. This is Shankri. Buddha and Shankar together, one arm. Cool one. Oh, I, I like, like it. it. Okay, take, what do I say? Take my card. Okay, give me your card. Take it, sir. Here we have some food, some sweets. Sweets. Gulab jamun. Gulab jamun. Yeah, Hindustani sweet, no? Yes. Hello, boys. Koi baat nahi, medeko. Koi baat nahi. Thank you. Namaste, sir. Wow. One name jalebi. Jalebi. Can I try one? One. One jalebi. I want to try one. I never tried jalebi. Let's try an Indian sweet. Okay. You place it one second. Very hot. Okay. Very hot. Okay. I'm gonna find some change for you. Samosa. Samosa I don't want. How much is it? It's yeah, enough? 20 rupees. 20? Yeah. I only gave you 10. 10 rupees. Does it matter? Okay. Ah, you're a good man. <laughs> I like it. What are you eating? Yik yeah. Satora. Yes, sir. Achha. Aapka, aapka jalebi bhi hai, na? Achha, mere peli baat. Achha, let's try it. Hot. <laughs> it's okay. okay. I like it. Very oily, but it's okay. Sweet. I like it. Okay, not bad. What about up? Come on, Yeah, what? Yeah, Hindi ne bolte. Are ya? Kya? Koi baat nahi. Okay, not everyone speaks Hindi here. By the way. All right, let's carry on down while I eat my jalebi. 
Jalabi. People here having tattoos. Henna tattoos. What about that? Ah, be name manka. Wow, Sundar henna. Sundar. From England. Oh, Namaskar ji. Ye aapke makan hai, dukan hai na? Shankar ji. Shankar ji. Lingam hai na? Sai Baba, Buddha. Sab bhagwan hai aapke pas. Acha, okay. You're a religious person. Or sab? Huh? Very unique. Yeah. Tattoo on my head for Shankar ji. Acha. Jai bola ki. All right, Satsuki ka sada ji. Okay, listen, let's carry on. Anyway. No, we've got other people here vlogging as well. We've got Korean or Japanese. Hello. Hello. Where are you going? Hi. Do you like India? Yeah. What's, what's your favorite thing? Yeah, here. Okay. Well, there you go. Tried a little bit of flirting there with some tourists. All right. Anyway, where were we? I've lost track of what I was saying. Here's a guy selling padlocks and knives. Hello, Wajab. Oh. Wow. Nice. Chota dukan here? A cha dukan here? Chota. Chota dukan. A little shop, but a nice shop. Wow, I'm being... got to watch out for the doors. You have to be very agile in India to weave through the crowds. If you don't have good hip movement, you'll never weave through the crowds without getting hit. Anyway, let's carry on. I don't really want this. It's too much for me. Foreign tourists here, like I was saying. Okay, I want to show you something. There were some terrorist attacks in Pahar Ganj a number of years ago. I forget when exactly and hotels were destroyed and blown up. And for this reason, they have bomb detecting, no, they have metal detecting gates on every hotel door. But look at this. No one cares what you have. You watch when I walk through this door. What do I up? Here's the metal detector. What? But nobody cares. There's no one there like, although it went off, no one cares. So they just put them there because the law requires every hotel in Pahar Ganj, maybe in Delhi, I don't know, maybe in Delhi, to have like a metal detector. But no one pays any attention to them. So it's kind of a bit strange. Oh, the way's up. Hey, my Whoa. Are ya? All right, let's carry on looking around. More shops here. You can buy ladies' dresses here. Are ya? What shall I do with this? What's called name on the Ariya, where's the bin? I don't want to throw it away. It's a waste, but I don't want to eat it. Okay, here we are. It's actually quite nice. Jalabi, my first one. Here we have a shoe shop. Here we have some people coming down from some stairs. Salam alaikum. Oh, I like these bags. Like kind of traditional Rajasthani style. I've thrown my jalabi away. I've wasted food. I'm a bad man. Up here we have Jama Masjid, Kaziwali. It's a mosque in the middle of the bazaar. So, as I was saying before, before I kind of got sidetracked by what I was saying, is that Bahar Ganj, people, tourists come to Bahar Ganj, not because it's the cleanest area or because it's the best area. Tourists come to Bahar Ganj because you have everything that you can want. You have money changers, Raman money exchange. You have shops selling clothes for tourists, dresses and different things that people like. You have hotels that are very cheap. You have restaurants. You have tourist um, places where you can buy like tourist, um, what would you call it? Souvenirs, I suppose. And so people for that reason come to Bahar Ganj. Let's carry on looking around. There's some food over here. Let's check it out. Some street food. What do I sub? There's a digger. Right. How are you going from? And this is chicken. Wow. It's like tandoori chicken, huh? That's right. I give the face of the tandoori chicken. Egg piece. 100 rupees, egg piece, huh? That's right. Namaskar. How are you, sir? How are you? Okay. 100 rupees is like $1.20 for some um, tandoori chicken. As you get further down Pahar Ganj, it gets a little bit less touristy and more catered for Indian people. At the end of Pahar Ganj, at the end of Pahar Ganj is the railway station, the biggest railway station in Delhi. And so that's one reason why people who have like connections overnight and they need to stay the night in Delhi, they walk up from the railway station to Pahar Ganj and they stay the night in Pahar Ganj in some cheap hotel and then they go and catch their train in the morning. India is such a huge country, sometimes there aren't direct trains, say from Srinagar in the north to Trivandrum in the south, you need to change in Delhi or something. All right, let's carry on looking around. 
They have everything here in Pahar Ganj. Let's have a look over here. One hunt, I've seen a good bargain. Wow, wait there. Crossing the road is very dangerous. You say, hello. What do I say? Namaskar, ji. 150, Hana? One fifty. England me bot me hanga na. A yahan pe bot sasta hai na. Ye Hindustan hai. Barat. One fifty for some tracksuit bottoms. That's basically two dollars. Not a bad, not a bad, um, not a bad deal. If you're in the, if you're in the market for some tracksuit bottoms. Here we have a um, music shop. Wow. Let's check it out. Where are you going? That's my answer. Wow, here you got Westerns. What about you? What do you have here? What do you have here? Musical instruments. Is it a guitar? It's a guitar. Okay. Hey, I don't know how to play a guitar. I don't know how to play a guitar. Hey, everything here. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. What do you have here? Yo, what do you have here? YouTube, right? YouTube. Camera, right? Camera, right? Yes. Film. Assalamu alaikum, sir. All right, let's carry on. Hello, girls. Hello. Don't follow me. The girls are following me. I don't know why. Right. Okay, anyway. So we've got here electrical store. Most of this stuff will be not original. What about you? What do you have? What's up here? Speakers, Anna. Oh, this is very important for a foreigner here, for a tourist. Selfie sticks, headphones, everything. You can buy everything in the great Bahar Ganj. Am I changing your mind? Are you starting to have a new opinion about Bahar Ganj? Are you starting to think, you know what? Bahar Ganj ain't that bad. Maybe I will come down to Bahar Ganj and do some shopping. Or not. Or are you thinking, what an absolute hellhole? Off Bahar Ganj, there are lots of little alleyways. And these alleyways go off in different directions. And they lead to like different hotels and restaurants. And here's a beautiful shop selling all kinds of bags and stuff. Wow, like Rajasthani style. I like it. Bags, kidna pesa? Yeh wala. 200, 200, really? Wow, my God, may I look? Okay, tell me then, how, like, how much is this one? 300 rupees, sir. It's like four dollars, US dollars, only four dollars. Yes. But someone made this, hand stitching. Yes. How is it possible? <laughs> wow. Are ya, bot sundar products hai na? Ye sundar, ye sundar, ye sundar, ye bhi sundar hai na? Oi, namashka, sir. Okay, me vapas, tika, sir. Then you are. You see, you can buy something that's hand stitched so beautifully. For like four dollars. How is that possible? Hey, Abine, boy, sir, Abine. Chello, 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 Pakistan. One hour sightseeing. Are ya Abine, mangda? Hey, Pahar Ganj, my, what about you? How is it? Okay. So you're gonna get a lot of people in Pahar Ganj. <laughs> he was spitting on the street. This guy. <laughs> He was having a little spit on the street. Indian people, not Indian ah. people, I shouldn't say that. Some people like ah, to ah. spit on the street. <laughs> anyway, you can buy some good bargains here in the old Bahar Ganj. A lot of tourists come here. In fact, a lot of foreigners come here to do wholesale shopping. And they fill their bags up with all different stuff and they take it back to their countries and they sell it. In England, in Russia, in Ukraine, in wherever, in Germany, in America, in Canada. And that's what they do. They make a living like this by coming to Pahar Ganj, buying lots of products. Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? What's your name? Krishna. 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 Um, and that's what they do. They make a business out of it. Because Pahar Ganj is, um, there's a lot of cheap things to buy here. The quality isn't the best here, but the prices are very cheap. All right, come on then, let's look further. We're going to walk down. Hello. Hello. Where are you going? Hello. 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 Um, oh, I keep losing track of what I'm saying, man. We're walking down to the end of Bahar Ganj, which is where the railway station is, New Delhi railway station. Um, so I just want to show you this one street of Bahar Ganj. Here's like a fruit seller. He makes juices and stuff like this. Pomegranate, orange, tangerines. Wow, it's so noisy. This is a thing in India, if you're a tourist, you have to be prepared to take the noise. 
if you don't like noise, if you don't like hustle and bustle, don't come to India, okay? Or if you come to India, go to Ladakh. Yeah, maybe go to Arunachal Pradesh, but don't come to Delhi, don't come to Mumbai, don't come to Varanasi, it'll be too crazy for you. But anyway, let's carry on exploring. Let's go to the end of the road and we'll see what we can find down there. I see some, some interesting products up ahead. Let's go and check it out. There's a guy here selling socks. Oi, what's up? 80 rupees. 80 rupees, okay, take us up. 80 rupees for three pairs of socks. That's one dollar. Okay. Over here is 150 sale. Everything seems to be 150. Here we have dresses, beautiful dresses and skirts and things like this. And here we have like these, like pyjama kurta for men. And here we have skirts for women and trousers. All the things that like, you see when tourists come to India and they spend some time here, they tend to become kind of hippified. And they start to dress in a certain way that they wouldn't dress back home. You know, like in Thailand, people wear the beer chang t-shirts, like the singlets. But in India, especially the women, they go into this kind of hippie thing, you know, they want to be kind of like more Indian. And so they wear baggy pants. Well, this is a place to buy all that stuff. You can get the full hippie look in Pahar Ganj if you want. Wait, wait. Gawa, Sabdiga, Maria. Now then, here we have um, jockey and pop color. My future wife. My future ex-wife. Alright, wait up. Here we see up here, let me show you something. I'm gonna show you, everyone knows what Hindi looks like, but here we have a different script. Namaskarji. Ye konsa language hai na? Ye konsa writing? Ye Sri Lanka. Of course, up Sri Lanka sir. Ye Tamils ah cha 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 Sri Lankan language yeah. So this is Sri Lankan language. Maybe Tamil, I don't know, but it's Sri Lankan language. And so and here as well they have Ye be Sri Lankan. Acha? And Sri Lankan a Hindi guy. Ah ye Hindi hai na? Ye Hindi? Ne? Same as Sri Lankan. Ah ye Sri Lankan. I see. Oh, right. hello. We have a lot of customers of Sri Lanka. Why do Sri Lankan customers come here? For wholesale we or? We know their language. We have the goods, what, what we, they want. You speak Sri Lankan? Yes. But you are Indian? But, yeah. We, Which, have, we are Indian, but we help Sri Lankan people. Right, so right, right, Lankan. right. He's from Sri Lanka. You're from Sri Lanka, sir? And we can, can talk Sri ah, okay. Lankan language also. I don't know. How do I say hello in Sri Lankan? Aibovan. 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 Okay, G. Nice to meet you. Thank you, sir. I bovan. I learned a new word today in Sri Lankan. I bovan, bye. I bovan. Oh, 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 he doesn't know I bovan. He doesn't speak Sri Lankan like I speak Sri Lankan. All right, let's carry on looking around. Whoa, what's up? Hey, what about this funky little thing? We can get some Korean chicks. I recognise her from the Sai video. Oppa Gangnam Style. Good. Yes, sir. Good. Yeah. All right, then let's carry on. Oh, what's up? Yes, sir. Here we got the teddy bear market. Let's check it out. It's like a toy shop. Oh, without getting run over. Don't want to get run over when we cross the road. Here we go. Otherwise up, let me scratch you. Oh, wait. Yes, yeah. Maria. Maria. Yeah, I'll cut you. Otherwise up. Yes, yeah. Take it. Acha, what do you have? Teddy bears? Little monkeys? All kinds of things. Aeroplanes? I like it. Oh, God. Oh! Ganeshji! Are ya! Aye, very cool, hai na? Ganeshji, or what's up? Yes, sir. Tiga. Yaku do kane, na? Acha. Aka bagwan konsa? Amare bagwan sa? Sare bagwan. Sare bagwan, ye konsa bagwan, na? All gods. All gods. All gods. Shankaji. Yes. Wow. Krishnaji, Ganeshji, Sareshwati. Are ya! Sai Baba bi. Are ya! Okay, I not disturb you because you have customers. Thank you. This is the best shop in Pahar Ganj. Very cheap. Please buy something. It's a very cheap shop. Sabse acha dukan hai Pahar Ganj mein. Might get a commission if I say that. Orway, ye kya hai? Goggles. Goggles. I've been named goggles. I don't want goggles right now. Orway, sir. Aapko kahan se? Kirojpur, Punjab. Punjab se? Yeah. Acha. Kaun se gaon? Kirojpur. Proper Kirojpur. Oh, I don't know this town. Okay. Indian Pakistan border. Indian Pakistan border. Yeah. And why are you in Delhi? Are you army? Yes. Hey, sir, thank you for looking after India and keeping India safe. Jai Jivan, Jai Kisan, Jai Hind. Jai Bharat. Jai Bharat. I use that phrase finally. 
अरे यार भाई साहब कहाँ जाना All right, we're almost coming to the end of it. What do you reckon, guys? What do you reckon to Pardagand? It's not that bad, right? I mean, it's not the greatest. It's not South Mumbai or some fancy place or whatever. But you know what? If you want to buy some goods, if you want a cheap hotel for the night because you're waiting for a train, if you want a little bit of food, if you want a Rolex, अरे यार क्या है यहाँ पे? है Rolex है यहाँ पे? आपके पास? यहाँ पे कौन है? अरे भाई फेक रोलेक्स है आपके पास रोलेक्स कहाँ है कैसी में चाहिए भाई साहब हाँ फर्स्ट कॉपी मांगते हैं ना रोलेक्स में फर्स्ट कॉपी नहीं है भाई साहब हाँ कौन सा सेकंड कॉपी सेकंड थर्ड कॉपी थर्ड कॉपी हाँ थर्ड कॉपी नहीं मांगते भाई साहब कोई बात नहीं नहीं भाई साहब we have third copy only. I want first copy Rolex. I'm determined to find the first copy Rolex one day in India. It's my dream, so I can walk around with a fake Rolex. Oh, out of the way, girls, coming through. Whoa. Almost fell into a chick. What was up, Kawa? Kanjana. Yeah, bad kid. Getting a little bit hectic down here. Here's the um. Sleeping bag. What is it? Sleeping bag. Ah, sleeping bag. Okay, I'm okay. I'm okay. I don't need a sleeping bag just now. Rolex, yeah, boys up. A Rolex, yeah. First copy. Rolex. नहीं है। Rolex, Rolex from there। अरे यार, Rolex नहीं है यहाँ पे। हाँ। मुझको Rolex मांगता ना? Rolex मांगता कौन? अरे यार, first copy मांगता। हाँ, first copy। अरे यार, ये क्या है? Power pack sir। Power pack नहीं मांगता, Rolex मांगता। Rolex। All right, no Rolexes it seems। पिसी, और बस अब। आ Rolex? अरे यार। Rolex है ना? ये कहाँ पे Rolex जोड़ी हो? First copy Rolex है? कौन? Ah, अरे यार भाई ये first copy नहीं है भाई साहब। ये second copy है ना, third copy है ना। Second copy है सर। अच्छा 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 कोई बात नहीं। I want first copy Rolex। कोई बात नहीं। दानी भाई साहब। क्या हुआ? हाँ। और भाई? क्या हुआ? यहाँ पे क्या? चाय है ना? अच्छा। मैं देखो कोई बात नहीं। मैं देखो। देखो मैं। अच्छा? मसाला चाय। अच्छा? Wow, and no spilling inside. Very good, skillful man. And biscuits, Palaji, kind. Palaji, nee, Palaji. Are ya? Palaji nee. Kyu nee? Quality acha hai. Are Palaji. G is for genius. G for glucose. Okay, glucose. Okay, glucose. Palaji. All right, let's look around. We're almost at the end. What about sab? Yeah, sab tiga bariya na. Here we have eggs that you can buy eggs here and noodles, Maggi. Indian people love Maggi noodles. They really love... Oh! What's up? Yeah, what's up? What's up? What's up? Where are you, sir? Pleased to meet you, sir. Where are you, sir? I'm from Calcutta. Wow, you traveled so far from Calcutta to Delhi. Delhi. Wow, you speak Bengali? Yeah, Bengali. Can you teach me one word of Bengali? How to say acha in Bengali? Balwachi. Balwachi. Acha. Balwachi. Okay, thank you, sir. Balwachi. Balwachi. Bengali language. Balwachi. You're Bengali? No, no, Bengali. No? India. Oh, just this guy's Bengali. Yeah, he's Indian. Acha, okay. Tiga, tiga. Tiga, nice to meet you, sir. Nice to meet you. Ekor bar, kesa? Balwachi. 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 Karori rachi. Chawal kati. Chawal kati. Chawal kati. Chawal kati. Okay. Well, we're coming to the end, but I'm going to have a last couple of minutes in case we meet any more fun people like this. This down here is the restaurant part. Here we have the Papada Hotel. Hotel in India doesn't necessarily mean a hotel where you stay. I learned that in Mumbai. A hotel can mean restaurant. Wow, over here we have like a bullock coming down the street. In the middle of the traffic, we have a bullock carrying some wood and stuff. ये हिंदुस्तान है ना ये बारात है and this is what happens sometimes you sit wow तंदूरी चिकन है ना wow सही सी है ना अच्छा 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 ये कितना पैसा कितना पैसे ये कितना two hundred full kebab and how much for one chicken one chicken कितना पैसा four hundred you can have a whole just burped. You can have a whole chicken for five five dollars. That's not bad. Tandoori chicken. What would a tandoori chicken cost you in your country? I reckon more than five dollars. If you're not Indian. Alright, sir. Yes, sir. Maria. 
Hey, I'm enjoying this. I'm getting in the mood now. I mean, the video's been going on. Let me check how long it's been going on for. It's been going on for 30 minutes. I suppose I should stop it. But I'm having so much fun. I'm meeting people. I'm seeing interesting things. There's even cool people here with smiles on my side. Here's the buddy. I'm meeting fun people, but I think maybe it's time to end the video, unfortunately. I don't want to carry on forever and ever. Here's some eggs. Here we go. People making some eggs and some Maggie noodles. Did I finish what I was saying before about Maggie noodles? Indians seem to love Maggie noodles. Maggie noodles are like the ones that you boil, you know, you pour water on. Um, but even in restaurants, you can get Maggi noodles sometimes. It was really strange for me the first time I saw in a restaurant that they sold Maggi noodles. I'm like, what? You can buy like, just boil, boil in the bag noodles in a restaurant. Here's like some rubbish collecting place. Okay, I don't want to show this because it's not about rubbish today. It's about other things, about shopping and stuff. Wow, but here's a pot market. You want to buy pot? Hey, you want some pot, brother? You want some pot, brother? You want, you want a little bit of pot? Okay. I'll, um, I'll sort that out for you. Here's some pots. What about that? Yes, sir. Can you Railway station. Here we go. You can buy some pots here. And here we have, ah, oh, but actually here they have chillums. So you can put your marijuana in the chillum and you can have a smoke. I like it. Oh, namaskar ji. Do you have to here? No? Okay. Someone gave me the evil look there. I said, is it your shop? And she looks at me like, what are you talking about, scumbag? That's okay, that happens. Namaskar ji. Yaka do kane. Acha. Oh, money pot for money saving. Pesa. Acha. Pesa nahiye. Bankrupt. Are ya mere pas nahiye. Namaskar ji. Chilam hai na? Acha. Wow, masks and gun party and all these different things. Here we have like things to smoking. Bom Mahadev. Wow, what do you reckon then? Should we call it quits? Oh, I don't want it to end. I want to carry on for like another hour just talking to you guys and showing you this stuff. Hey, there's a guy over there saying, hey guys. How are you, brother? Okay. All right, Vaisab, how's it going? Okay, okay. What's your name? Hello, guys. All right, Vaisab, how's it going? Okay, okay. Orange juice. I'm very good. What's your name? My name is Mr. Hakim Khan. Mr. Hakim Khan. Hakim Khan. Assalamu alaikum, bhai. Yes, small brother. Nazim Khan. Nazim Khan. Nazim Khan. Assalamu alaikum. Okay, I'm looking around for Harganj. I'm showing my friends. Yes, sir. Tell Mani Chok. Tell Mani Chok. In Paharganj, New Delhi. New Delhi. You see this? How friendly these people are. They came over. YouTube. You will be famous in India. <laughs> Everything available. All juices. I like it. Brother, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Kuda Hafiz. Anyway, Shukriya sir. Nice people. As I was saying, as I was saying, I would like to carry on walking around and showing you more. There's so much more to explore here. But um, I understand that I don't want to make this video too long and just go on myself. All right, Jay Boleki, let's end the video. Let me know in the comment section what you think about Bahar Ganj now. Is it still, is it still so terrible like you thought before? Or actually, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. I've just seen my girlfriend. I've just seen my girlfriend. Hi, right, sir. Okay, sir. Who is this? This is my future wife, right? I heard that you got married in, in in Italy. How dare you betray me? I thought we had something together. Okay, I forgive you. Future ex-wife. Future ex-wife. All right, guys. Let's um. Let's give it a final J Boleki, and let's get. Wow, there's a fight going on. Kiawa, kill? Why you punch him? Fighting. Are they fighting? Yeah. Fighting. Fighting. Fighting? Who is stronger? He's champion. What? Huh? All right, guys. Uh, for YouTube. YouTube. Showing friends. Yes, sir. Hello, what's up? Kanjana, kiawa. All right, All right, you know the thing in India, there's always something interesting happening. So it's difficult to stop the video because you want to stop and then you meet some interesting person again. 
But at some point, you've got to say, you know what, that's it, enough. And um, I'm going to say that now, you know? All right, guys, it's been real fun. Um, Firmilenge, Jay Bolaki from Bahar Ganj.